virtual air guitar, you know the Red Hat already. Yeah. Uh, if you don't, now you do. Uh, so I just, I didn't have any materials prepared. I really would have wanted to, but um, couldn't find any suitable videos. Uh, I want to say a few words about video prototypes, what they are and how to use them. So it's a technique I've used a few times. It means um, a slightly more advanced version of a paper prototype. You know what a paper prototype is when you just sketch something uh, without any code or any assets. A video prototype is like a faked prototype without actual interactivity. You can do it in the engine, you can fake it uh, in a video editor, whatever gets the job done. But the idea is that um, you don't have to spend a lot of time programming something that is very code intensive when you can just fake it in a video and you still get a good feeling about the flow of how it's going to work and how it's going to feel. Because often, especially in the age of streaming, how a game looks to play is a super important thing to, to uh, explore right at the beginning of the prototyping stage. So uh, I've often been in projects where we would have had to implement uh, a lot of stuff to get an interactive prototype. And this one time we had uh, an artist working on um, a platform, a platformer uh, prototype. So they just uh, laid out some art assets in Unity, attached a basic character controller and then recorded some video and then post processed some effects on top of that. And that was actually a really cool thing that took like one day to make and it uh, showed how a platformer could feel like. So that's it. I would have wanted to show that uh, video that the artist made, but uh, sadly I do not have the company today. Mm -hmm. really Thank fun. you. Yeah.